my name is Rita I am a fitness and nutrition coach and in this video we are going to be working on our lungs which is so important I've been getting so many requests from my followers and or my subscribers and clients to work out on our lungs now a uh, good lung capacity and respiration is anyways important for a long and healthy life but uh, given the situation of pandemic today it's even more important so we are going to be uh, doing some yoga poses that increase your lung capacity and in the end we are going to be doing breathing exercise so let's start with your hands at the back of your head and we are just going to breathe this is not a yoga asana or anything simple breathing to increase your lung capacity so you're going to inhale deeply with your nose and exhale with your nose again pay attention to your lungs and your chest expand as you breathe in and relax as you breathe out keep going five more breaths like this this is going to ensure that you're increasing the volume of air that you take into your lungs and breathe out with your nose breathe in breathe out breathe in expand your chest create space for your lungs and breathe out breathe in breathe out and last one breathe in expand and breathe out now we are going into a mat we'll go down to a mat to do some simple yoga exercises all right so for first asan sit down on your mat on your butt with your legs extended uh, the pose is called ardha matsendrasana but don't worry about the complicated name you want to fold one knee across your thigh to the other side all right hug your knee in and make sure your spine is straight you're going to extend the hand opposite you need that you fold it place it here and twist your body and breathe make sure your spine is straight and look back place your hand behind your back now here we are opening up the sides of our lungs so we are going to work on every part of the lung the front back and the side to make sure each part of your lung is working to its fullest capacity take five breaths inhale exhale You can do this for as long as you want. But for the purpose of this video, just doing it five breaths each side. And that's enough. It's hardly going to be a 15 minute of routine, but done every day this can be very very helpful to increase your lung capacity. See how my back is straight? Don't slouch. Inhale. and twist look back inhale through your nose and exhale through your nose again So the next one we are going to do is cobra pose. So we are going to lie down on our belly, and again, any kind of a back bend is going to open up your chest. 
So that is why cobra pose will work. Any kind of back back bend will really work to open up your lungs. So I want you to place your palms, lie down on your belly, place your palms next to your chest, and inhale. Make sure your toes are pointed and relaxed. Inhale and come up. Breathe. Relax your toes. Press into the mat with your palms. Again, we are just opening up our lungs here, letting the air in. And if this is difficult for you, you can even do the Sphinx pose, which is on your elbows. This is a much more relaxed variation, and you can do it for a longer time. So just breathe normally. Or outdoor space, so that you get enough of oxygen. That's very important. There are trees and plants around, nothing like it. One more breath. pose that we are going to do is how I'm like in the Suri position. Uh, it's called Matsendrasana in yoga. So you're just going to keep your palm one on top of the other and rest your head. Nothing but the pruning position which has become so popular nowadays. And now we are going to focus on the back. So as you inhale, feel, feel the air filling up the back of your lungs. And exhale, the back comes down, inhale, exhale, this is so easy, anyone can do it, even someone suffering from COVID can do it and they must do it in fact, it's recommended by doctors. I'm sorry, the asana is called Makarasana. I got confused. Don't force your breath too much. Just intend to breathe deeply and let it happen. If you do these exercises every day, you will increase your lung capacity and respiratory health. Three more breaths here. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, last time, inhale, and exhale. Okay, come up slowly, open your eyes, and now we are going to do breathing exercises I hope you're feeling relaxed and oxygenated so let's take a few breaths in the sitting position cross leg or whatever position you are comfortable in inhale and I want you to focus on your chest your thoracic cavity expanding it inhale and exhale 
inhale, exhale. I'm not doing any pranayam or the advanced breathing exercises. This is just simple breathing. This is done in the outdoor area or in the morning fresh air. It's enough to oxygenate you. Place your hands below your ribs or just where your ribs are ending below your chest. And I want you to feel your chest expanding sideways your rib cage expanding sideways as you breathe in. So breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in. Not just oxygenating our lungs here, but we also breathe out, working on the muscles that are used for expansion and compression of your rib cage. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Two more breaths. Go at your own pace. See if you can work those back muscles as well. Your rib cage expands at the back side too. Last breath. Now, last exercise. Um, we are going to do five rounds of first lip breathing. So you are going to inhale from your nose. And exhale from your mouth. Make your lips in a shape like kind of you're whistling. One more time, breathe in. From your nose and exhale from your mouth. Keep your exhalation slow, relaxed, and long. Inhale. Inhale, exhale through your mouth, last breath, inhale, and exhale. Okay, now come back to your normal breathing, just relax basically. And that's the end of the video. We work on our lungs, on the muscles that control the expansion and uh, contraction of our rib cage, and we worked on oxygenating uh, our whole body because oxygen goes into all of our body through the lungs and the lung airway. So please like, share, and subscribe this video if you found it helpful. Save it for later and share it with as many people as you can. We really need this, especially people recovering from COVID. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye and take care. Stay positive.